Hi, I'm Marlo Flewelling. And I'm Emily Sellen. And we're public education officers with Mississauga Fire and Emergency Services. Sometimes with our busy lives, it's easy to forget the things that matter most. This week is Carbon Monoxide Awareness Week, and we'd like to show you a few tips to keep you and your family safe from carbon monoxide. Carbon monoxide is a toxic gas. It's a gas that you cannot see, smell, or taste, and therefore is sometimes known as a silent killer. Carbon monoxide alarms can be the difference between life and death, and we need them in our homes. Let's go on inside and we'll learn a little bit more. The main sources of carbon monoxide in your home are things like furnaces, water heaters, gas-fueled appliances such as stoves or dryers, as well as fireplaces. An attached garage is also another source of carbon monoxide. You should be aware that if you have any of these in your home, you do require a working carbon monoxide alarm. Carbon monoxide alarms need to be installed outside all sleeping areas, but for added protection, you can have one on every story of your home. They can be installed on your ceiling or they can be plugged into your wall. It's important to test your carbon monoxide alarms monthly. Check the replace by or expiry date and make sure that they are replaced every 10 years. Testing your carbon monoxide alarm is as easy as this. Push the button and listen for the sound. That's how we know that it's working. The most common signs of carbon monoxide poisoning are headache, drowsiness, and nausea. If you're experiencing flu-like symptoms without the fever, this may be a sign that you have carbon monoxide poisoning. If you believe that you have been exposed to carbon monoxide, or if your carbon monoxide alarm sounds, you need to evacuate to fresh air immediately and call 911. A carbon monoxide alarm is not a substitute for a smoke alarm, and a smoke alarm is not a substitute for a carbon monoxide alarm. Carbon monoxide alarms beep four times, and smoke alarms beep three times. Regardless of whatever alarm is going off in your home, you need to evacuate immediately and call 911 once you're safely outside. We hope these safety tips keep you and your family safe from carbon monoxide poisoning. Stay safe, everyone.